Hey guys, it's me. I am here on our new channel with a little haul. Um, I just ordered some new Mac stuff. I was very good. I didn't buy very much. I say that every time and then I, as I'm reviewing it and showing you guys, I'm like, oh, I need to go back and get some more. Um, so yeah, anyway, I got some new Mac stuff. They have their posh I think it's Posh Paradise collection out now where it's just paint pots and matching lipsticks. So I got a few paint pots and I got some matching lipsticks. But first I wanted to show you the Bloggers Obsession collection is, uh, is about to go offline or it's already offline. Anyway, I got an email telling me that it was about to go away and I said, oh my gosh, I have got to get on there. And because you know everything sold out and I got Jealousy Wigs and then Parisian Sky. So I got back on there because I'm obsessive and I got another <laughs> Parisian Skies. I got a backup. And if you guys, if you guys, if you guys have watched my other video um, about the, can you see? Um, no, you can't see because that's upside down. Wow, really? Um, if you watched my other video about the bloggers obsession collection then you have heard me rave about this color I love this color I have nothing like this and I have a gazillion blue eyeshadows I don't know why I always gravitate towards blue but I have a million of them so for me to find a blue eyeshadow that I love more than anything else in the world that's a big deal because I have a lot of blue eyeshadows so I love this one it is a very like overcast sky blue um with a lot of gray, like gray base. Do I have lipstick on me? Um, a gray base with dark navy sort of shimmer. And I can't ever remember the blogger that made this, but you're a genius. I love it. And so I have two and I bought a backup of this. And then I went back and got um, Hocus Pocus because I wanted to try it. And Haley got it and said that it was gorgeous. So of course I had to get it too. I have Jealousy Wakes. Um, but I didn't really feel like I needed a backup of that one. But I did get a backup of Parisian Skies and then I got Hocus Pocus. Which looks like this. Oh my goodness, do you see the shimmery, beautiful goodness? It is crazy pretty. Um, it's almost like an antique gold brown pewter. That's the best way I can think to describe it. Um, it's a mix of all those colors and it is just beautiful. Oh my gosh. Look at the swatch. It's a very, it's very more gray. On the gray side it has a gray base. But then I see some antique gold and brown in there. I love this. I'm so excited that I got it. So this is Hocus Pocus. It's just a bunch of Hocus Pocus. I love that movie. So I got that. And that's all I got from the Bloggers Obsession collection because I knew that I needed to get some stuff before it went offline or else I would regret it. And Haley would never hear the end of it because <laughs> I'd be upset. Okay, now for Posh Paradise. And you guys are lucky because I just got this in the mail. So you're getting a first look. I'm getting a first look. Um, I just literally opened... Uh, my door and this is on my doorstep so I ended up getting three paint pots because I love paint pots <laughs> and you can never have enough seriously they're the best things ever they don't crease they don't fade they're the best eyeshadow bases they're amazing and for me I get up really early in the morning I go to work I have to be at work at 7 30 I love these because I can just throw them on and go I don't have to mess with an eyeshadow, a crease shade, all that stuff. I just put on a paint pot and go, and I'm out the door. So I love paint pots. I can't have it. I cannot have too many. I already have four, so I added three more. Okay, the first one I got was Genuine Treasure, and I had to get this one. It's not really a surprise. I think Haley ended up getting it too because it's just a very us color. Um, again, it's an antique gold color but look at all the shimmer 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 look and you can tell I have not swatched it yet so you're going to get a first swatch let's see what the consistency is like it's just I mean it's the same consistency as all paint pots that is beautiful this is much more of a brown base than hocus pocus hocus pocus I would say is more of a gray pewter base this is more brown with a lot of gold this would probably look good 
as a base for Hocus Pocus, actually. Very, very pretty. And it, I like it. I was kind of afraid of this one now that I've swatched it. Um, can you see? It's this. Ooh, that's pretty. Um, now that I've swatched it, I was kind of worried when I saw the swatches online. Because I have to order everything online. I don't live by a Mac. Um, unless I'm in my hometown. Um, but the place that I live at now, there's not a Mac. There's not even a mall here. <laughs> it's a very small town. Um, I have to order everything online, so I have to go buy online swatches. So I'm really relieved that that's not chunky like the uh, Champagne Collection um, paint pots. Those are really chunky glitter, and it was kind of hard to get a, uh, a good base uh, or a, a good eyeshadow to go over them smoothly. So that's a relief. That seems a lot smoother. Um, okay, and then the next one I got, I've got to hurry because this video is going to be so long. Um, the next one I got is Hyperviolet. You can't even read that because it's dark. I don't know if you can see it. Okay, but it is a crazy, I don't have anything like this. It is a crazy, like, midnight violet color. Look at that. Seriously, that would be beautiful as a liner. And then I have this other color from Glam Couture Cosmetics. Get online and check it out. It's called Pom Pom Dahlia. And I think I, I think I've swatched it in like older videos, so you'll have to go look. But it's the craziest purple color. And I thought when I ordered this, oh my gosh, that'll be perfect. Underneath my Pom Pom Dahlia. So that's why I got this. And yes, it is amazing. Look at that. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. This is so exciting. So exciting. Sorry. It's the little things in life, okay? You got to get excited about the little things. All right. There's a fly, and that makes me sad. I don't like that at all. Okay. So, that is what that looks like. Sorry. My swatch is kind of... I have the fan on because it's so hot in here. This in between, that is Hocus Pocus, by the way. Um, but there's my swatch of Hyperviolet. Oh my gosh. So stinking pretty. And then the last one I got was Nubile. Which isn't, can you tell where I'm wiping it off? Which isn't particularly exciting, but I thought it would be a good everyday color. Um, like I said, I get up really early and I just want something easy to throw on. It's sort of, oh, it's sort of a skin toned color. I assume that it will be a good base to just kind of blot out the color on my eye. This will be a good eyeshadow base, yes. It's more of a peachy tone than uh, anything. But it's just a neutral color. Can you see it? It is right there. Very pretty. I like that. Nothing too exciting, but I really, really like it. And then the two matte teen lipsticks I got were, are, <laughs> uh, Seeds of Desire and Deliciously Forbidden. Seeds of Desire is what I have on my lips right now. And it is very dark, very intense, a lot darker than I thought it would be. So you like, like skin girls, like tone girls, um, be aware because, oh my gosh, this is a lot. This is a lot for me, but I really like it. I always like the really dark colors and then I'm like, I don't know if that looks very good. So I don't know. I'm going to have to give this one a little bit longer to test because it is very dark, but this is what it looks like. This is Seeds of Desire. It's a very brown based plum red color. Okay, seriously, there's a fly and it's freaking me out. I hate flies. I hate them. I hate summer because of the flies. Um, it swatches very brown, but on my lips, obviously, it's more of a violet purple color. So, that's what it looked like swatched. So, I really like this color. It's dark, but I really do like it. And then this one is, I can't even remember the name, Deliciously Forbidden. And it's sort of a purple color. So, no surprise there. I love purple lipsticks. They're my favorite thing in the whole world. If you haven't figured that out yet, I live for purple lipsticks. I love them. I don't know why. I just love them. So this is more of a like magenta pink purple color. And I'm very happy about it. I love it. Oh yeah. If you haven't ever tried these Mattine lipsticks, look at that, oh my gosh. Hey, seriously, did you see it? Did you see the fly? Um, if you haven't ever tried the matching lipsticks, you need to try them because for a matte lipstick, the consistency is like butter. Because matte lipsticks tend to be very drying and um, 
you know, can kind of show all the imperfections in your lips. I love matte lipsticks, but yeah, they can be very drying. Um, so these Mattine lipsticks, as you can see, have a little bit of a sheen and they are amazing. They are so smooth and go on so nicely. I love them. So they're Seeds of Desire and there is Deliciously Forbidden. Deliciously Forbidden, I seriously love. I knew I would. So that is all for the Posh Paradise Collection and uh, Bloggers Obsession, just backups. I also got a Costa Reach, Costa, Costa Reach, um, eye coal, which is just a dark, dark, dark brown. Nothing too exciting, but I got that too because I need a dark brown coal eyeliner. I don't have one that's any good. Um, the Urban Decay ones don't show up other than zero. Like none of them show up on my waterline, so I need one for my waterline. Anyway, okay, so that's all I got. I will be back in just a little bit with more stuff from Hot Look and Sephora. So stay tuned, and I will see you in just a second. Bye, guys.